Hi everyone, this is Rob Loniger, and a user on eLearning Heroes asked if you could use live interactive polling within Articulate Storyline. And so it got me thinking, you know, there are a lot of services out there that allow people to interactively poll using their cell phones, mobile devices, everything else. So I decided to try it out, and it works. Uh, so here's how it goes. First of all, you want to go, want to go in your browser um, to a polling website, and this is Poll Everywhere, which is probably the, the most well-known outfit. And if you have an account, of course, you would sign up. I'm just going to use the guest account to create my first poll. And um, then I'm going to ask a question, and I'm just going to actually use that question right there. What is your favorite color? And then I want to make it multiple choice. And instead of true, false, I'm just going to say red, um, green, yellow, and blue. Um, their interface is really easy. And then I just want to create the poll. And so um, this is kind of your dashboard for this particular poll. And um, you can see here it's what is your favorite color. It gives some instructions on how people can respond. They can either go to um, a web page or they can use uh, SMS, a text message, by texting whatever these codes are to that little number there. And then I just want to um, go down here on the r lower right hand corner to where it says share and publish. And it tells me this is going to delete this poll in a couple of weeks because this is just sort of a sample account. But down here it says live visualization link. So I'm going to hover over that and then I want to copy this um, this website right here, this URL. So I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to come into Articulate Storyline and I'm going to insert a new blank slide and on this slide I want to insert a web object and so here um, in the web object wizard or the little dialog box I'm going to replace this little um, part with the URL for my live poll and I want it to display in the slide and when the slide opens I want the web object to go ahead and load up automatically and I'm going to click play or click OK. Now I have to actually publish this I cannot preview this as you normally would so I'm just I called this poll everywhere test and I'm going to publish it and um, what you want to do I, I'm just going to view this locally so I'm just finding it here in my um, Windows Explorer and I find out what the path is to this story file right here and so I'm just gonna find it right there story.html I'm gonna copy that and now I'm gonna come over to my browser and um, I already did a version earlier so I want to reload it. This is my new one. There's my first slide. I want to click Next. And notice this little animation here. It's loading up my poll. Now here's the really cool part. I have my text, I have my cell phone right here. And I'm going to send a text to that 22333 number. And I'm going to say that green is my favorite color. So I'm going to text 582914. 582. 914 and um, in just a moment by magic that will show up live on the screen it'll automatically update and there you see there's my vote so this is how you can utilize um, interactive polling within articulate storyline and if you have an account with one of these services um, then that you will be able to have a consistent poll that cumulatively um, displays votes that are cast over time. And you could also use it in a live face-to-face um, -face training environment too. I hope this helps.